In today's video, we're going to be reacting to some Aaliyah photos, but they're not just any Aaliyah photos. Someone was generous enough to share some photos of not Aaliyah, but her mother, Diane. I don't know who's feeling generous a couple days ago or yesterday. I think it was yesterday when I saw these. Somebody was feeling generous yesterday. And so they released beautiful photos of Miss Diane Houghton around, mm, let me look. Okay, these photos are of Mother Diane arriving to Anastasia movie premiere in New York, November 9th, 1997, 26 years ago. And it says that you can spot Aaliyah and Kidada in the carriage on the third slide. Now, we will be going through all these photos. So, before we do, like, comment, subscribe, turn on your bell post notifications so that you'll be notified every time I drop a video. Because that's going to be every day, maybe. So, let's get into these wonderful photos let's go to the first one and i am going to be sharing a bonus photo as well that they released that i've been wanting to share of Aaliyah herself so stay tuned to the end for that photo first photo is miss diane sitting in a carriage and you know me being a conspiracy theory you think all types of crazy stuff and when I first saw these photos, to be honest with you, for one, they're in a carriage. Wasn't Aaliyah in a carriage for her last ride? Maybe it has something to do with this and this was her most cherished experience and that's why they wanted to use a carriage and to take her home beautifully. But this carriage looks the same, but it's not about that. It just looks like a similar one she was in. That's all I'm saying. I'm not saying it's the same one. I love the glasses that look like something Aaliyah will wear. They were probably Aaliyah's glasses. Aaliyah stayed with the glasses, sleek, dope, but this is not about Aaliyah. Diane was so beautiful. I don't know what she looks like today, so I'm gonna say was. We don't see her in today's time at all. I think she did link with Aaliyah's old makeup stylist or hairstylist. It was one or the other. I think it was a makeup stylist. She linked with him and he said it himself. Uh, but he never showed her, unfortunately. We know whose mother this is. <laughs> and I love the guys in the uniforms. They look like nutcrackers. Here's a second pic of them helping her down. I wonder if this was planned for Aaliyah to arrive like this. I mean, it was... I understand why they're kind of dressed like that. It was just like a dreamy time, I'm sure, for her. And the cartoon is... I don't, I've don't i never seen a cartoon. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. Maybe I should watch it for the sake of Aaliyah. That would be smart. See if it has any subliminals or relatable things that can relate to Aaliyah. Maybe it does. Who knows? But she's just been being helped out of the carriage. She wore all white like her daughter. She has on the trench coat. What a better way to dress up in a trench coat during the era of Journey to the Past or Anastasia, same difference. I ain't gonna lie, when I first saw these photos, I was very ungrateful because I'm like, where's Aaliyah? <laughs> I'm always looking for Aaliyah, that's all I care about. No disrespect, like, of course we wanna see her mother. I would love to see her in today's time. You know, we wanna see pictures of her brother, dad, especially other family members, but more importantly, we, we love Aaliyah. I love Aaliyah, so. I thought these pictures were gonna include Aaliyah a little bit. It kind of does, but not really. Next picture is just the up close picture. She looks just like Aaliyah. I really wanna know what she has been up to today. I wish they would just show her, but given the fact of what happened to her daughter, she probably doesn't wanna be infatuated with the media. So she's just staying far away as possible. Or maybe they're threatening to use something against her if she makes an appearance. Who knows? I don't know. She did link with Aaliyah's makeup artist. So maybe something's coming. Who knows? <laughs> but I didn't look further into it. But she looks absolutely gorgeous. Here's the photo of Aaliyah and Kidara in the back of the carriage or 
on the other side whatever you want to consider it but when i was first looking at this i'm like yeah that's Aaliyah. but who's sitting next to her and then i was like that kind of looks like kidada and then i scrolled down on the post and it said Aaliyah and kidada and i'm like oh okay yeah i i know <laughs> it's not hard to tell even though this photo is very hard to see i think this was that time when Aaliyah had on that all white outfit isn't it and then Kidada had on the black denim outfit. I think that's what she was wearing. Yeah, I think it's that time. So they showed up in a carriage, an all-white carriage. Mom in all-white. Aaliyah in all-white. Of course, the uh, the friend had to be different, but she ain't a part of none of that. So, Well, she wasn't a part of none of that. But that's crazy. Because I think this is when Aaliyah had on that all-white. You can kind of see her white jacket in this. This is definitely that time. It, it's starting to ring a bell again, yeah. That was definitely that time. There's more pictures of Aaliyah on the red carpet. I never knew her mother went with her. That's interesting to know because I, I would always wonder, was Aaliyah going to those red carpets alone? Like just with friends or whoever she was with at the time or was there like family off to the side? What was it? But her mom was there. I don't, I don't see her dad though. I wonder why he wasn't there anymore. Maybe he stayed home to uh, accompany the brother. It could have been that. I don't know. Here's another picture of Miss Diane sitting in the carriage. I wonder who the lady is sitting next to her. Probably just somebody who works for them. And they even was pulled up to by a horse. Like there's a horse in front of the carriage and the man's driving it, of course. That's crazy. It must have been a dream for Aliyah and Kidada. They were just kids experiencing a lot. Just to pull up in a carriage, a horse pulling you, being on a red carpet, having your best friend, being successful, a singer. But Kidada did her own little thing. I know Kidada was a lot older than Aliyah though, but basically still a kid. But it must have been a dream for Aliyah. I, I definitely want to experience that. I don't know what I want to do, if it's acting or singing or whatever it is. I don't know, I think I wanna make music because I love music. I definitely would uh, sample from Aaliyah a lot because I love her, but definitely give her her credit, of course. But yeah, I already know that there's more pictures to this of them pulling up and Aaliyah getting out. But we're gonna patiently wait. We're not gonna be ungrateful. We love these pictures. We don't really get pictures of Diane. So to have gotten these, I was very shocked, I'm like, Whoa. Sometimes I forget what Aaliyah's mom looks like because there's just not really too many photos of her. It is a few, but not as much as Aaliyah. And then here's the bonus photo. When I saw this, let me tell you, I didn't even think she wore shirts like this at all. Like I just had this idea of how Aaliyah dressed away from the cameras, but no, this is like a club outfit. Aaliyah was doing it big. And also when I first saw this picture, I thought she had a tattoo by her boob. I was about to say, I did not know she had a tattoo before she... When I looked closer, because I kept looking at the photo, I'm like, she couldn't have had a tattoo unless it was fake. I kept looking, I'm like, oh, that is a sequence bra underneath a sequence shirt so it's not a tattoo that would have been pretty for her to get a tattoo right there though that would have been hot it would have gave off rihanna the leather pants the fitted leather pants with the glittery top i did not know Aaliyah was like this i'm always saying Aaliyah wasn't really into shimmery things i mean she really wasn't full blown into it she never introduced us to it the only shimmery outfit she had on was the one in try again that was it and the one in that photo shoot when she had on like a shirt that looked like this beautiful i love this photo it looked like she going to a club Aaliyah is definitely giving me ideas don't let me lose weight and get in shape i'm gonna act out and i'm going for Aaliyah's looks i don't care what nobody say i'm going for Aaliyah's looks and i'm gonna kill them period because Aaliyah was just that girl this photo is absolutely gorgeous this is a lucky fan all the fans that ever met her lucky this was from june 9th of 01 two months before her she was just living her best life and i'm glad she got to live her best life before she because she, she lived so much in her little time which is kind of a good thing because she's so young but she's so cute she was a dream girl i love this outfit i love the bra the shirt the pants 
Bro, I'm thinking about ordering some leather pants. <laughs> this picture is bomb. I, I rate this picture. This may be one of my new favorite pictures of Aaliyah. I would rate this one a 10 out of 10. A 100 out of 10. I love it so much. She was beautiful. Like, I get all my hairstyles from her. I never knew my love for an artist could be so strong. Because I don't like artists today, but... <laughs> I really love this picture. Aaliyah was hot. That's all I gotta say. This looks like a Charlie's Angels outfit if she played in that movie. Or like Romeo Must too. Cute. Anyways, that pretty much wraps it up for this video. I love this photo. I'm definitely gonna keep it forever. I wonder why it takes people so long to release it. I love this photo. I'm definitely gonna save this so that, you know, if it disappears, I'll have the original post and it won't have a watermark on it. Aaliyah, this looked like she was going to a club. I really wanna know where she was at because it looked like our girl was going to party. I, I, I didn't think she wore sequenced outfits. It was crazy. But anyways, that pretty much wraps it up for this video. I love reacting to pictures of Aaliyah and stuff like that. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm pretty sure somebody will be making these Diane photos in color. So just just give it time because they're black and white. And I bet Diane was very proud of her daughter for everything she had accomplished in her 22 years. Respectfully, something her mother couldn't do that she wanted to do, but it just passed down to her daughter and her daughter did it well. I will see you guys in my next video. Stay crazy.